tonight. Frightening video here. A driver speeding into oncoming traffic on I-85 with the bumper hanging off the back. The driver, as you can see on the road, that one's swerving into the median to get out of the way. The SUV lost control and spun out. Troopers say drivers nearly hit this vehicle in Rowan County. They threw out stop sticks. That did not work. But again, this all came to an end in Davidson County when that driver hit a tractor trailer and then hit a blue SUV head on. And sadly, in the end, that wrong way driver was killed on right. impact. The driver of the other vehicle, that SUV, is actually one of our engineers right here at the station. He suffered minor injuries to his arm, but tonight he's doing okay. I-85 South, a look at that tonight as the crash happened there at the exit to get onto Highway 64. Channel 9's Elsa Gillis is live at the scene tonight. Elsa, troopers say they still don't know why that driver was going the wrong way. Erica Scott, you see these cars moving in the lanes right below me. Well, just hours ago, there wasn't a single car in that southbound lane. This crash was so bad, it shut down that whole side of the interstate. And now, hours later, part of one lane is still blocked off with the involved tractor trailer still slowing down traffic right as we head into rush hour. It was like a movie. It was almost like a movie or something. You know, I was like, hold up, is this a car coming towards me? Just like a movie, except what happened here is very real with a terribly sad ending. Terrell Sutherland was one of many driving along 85 South this morning when this car, seen in this viewer video, came barreling towards him from the opposite direction. And she went like right past me. I mean, uh, she, she had to be going at least like 80 miles an hour or something like that. And she just was just flying by and then I swerved. State troopers say the driver got on the interstate around the Rowan and Davidson County line and drove for about 10 miles in the wrong direction. You can see in this video drivers dashing to either side of the roadway. This one even spinning out. Our Chopper 9 Sky Zoom captured the stop sticks used by police to slow her, but troopers say she kept going, eventually crashing into this tractor trailer, hitting its rear axle, then crashing head on into this blue SUV. Sutherland was just yards away as this unfolded. I actually swerved over to the lane that, that the, tra the trailer was in. So when I swerved over, I, she she kind of she was coming like coming at me. So but by the time I moved over, she had hit the back of the track, the trailer. Oh my gosh. So so when she hit the back of the track, the trailer, I mean, flames, everything just flames, smoke, and I'm like, somebody's not with us. I, I mean, I just knew. I said somebody's not with us after that after that impact. Troopers say that wrong way driver wasn't wearing a seatbelt and was killed. Miraculously, no one else was seriously hurt. I mean, I didn't know what was going on. I didn't know why, why she was coming out of this lane or, you know, what was going on with her, you know, today. You know, I just, I just pray for it. And that is the question we all still have. Why was she driving for so many miles in the wrong direction? This investigation is ongoing. We will update you as we learn more from troopers. Erica. All right, Elsa, thank you. And we'll be standing by as well to learn the identity of that female driver and keep her and her family in our prayers. If you want to take another look at that viewer video of the wrong way driver, we've posted the entire raw clip of the video on our WSOC app.